He's on our Hebridean sheep. So it's a small breed, um, black colouring, um, the cow horns, which I have to say, when it comes to handling them, it makes life a lot easier. And they're actually quite slow growing as well. But as you can see with you know, this one here, the adult, she needs shearing. Just as you might expect with just about any sheep. And they are sheared once a year. Now this ram here, born last year, as you can see, he's been shedding his wool. And indeed, the ewe just in front of him has been doing exactly the same. So, what's been going on? Now, the Hebrideans are a very old breed of sheep. Probably been around for thousands of years. Uh, so, they are more closely related to wild sheep. And that's the explanation as to what's been happening here. When humans first started keeping sheep, they wanted them for meat, possibly for milk, and for wool. But if the sheep were moulting naturally, then the wool would be lost, and that would be one fewer reason why people would want to keep sheep. However, through genetic mutation, some of the sheep that were kept by prehistoric man wouldn't have shed their wool just by mutation. So instead of that sheep naturally shedding its coat and growing a new one, it kept its old coat. Now, now that was fine for uh, prehistoric man because that meant that uh, he had a supply of wool. So, obviously, a sheep that, through mutation, kept its wool uh, was going to be of much more value to prehistoric man. And that's the explanation for what's been happening here. So, prehistoric man would have concentrated on the on keeping the sheep that kept their wool and therefore needed to be sealed, so they would get away from those sheep. Uh, they wouldn't have been interested in the sheep that uh, sealed their wool or most of it. But some of these genes have survived, uh, despite uh, the uh, prehistoric man's preference for uh, sheep that uh, kept the wool. As you can see, uh, our two rams there certainly don't mount their coats, uh, so they are going to be in the field in the next few days. So over time, prehistoric man would have built up flocks of sheep which were based largely on those animals that didn't shed their wool. So that's why we occasionally have sheep like that one there in our flock. And as you can see, she's molted most of her case. Most of her ears. So, that's the explanation for why this this lamb here uh, has shed its own coat. It's not finished yet, but uh, it's 90% done. Looks like it's got a lion's mane. 